First Give exists to inspire young people to make a difference to the causes that they care about. If you give young people the opportunity to do good, they will absolutely run with it. For me, it's all about that confidence that they develop through the programme, that they are not on their own, that they're part of a bigger community, and that when they take action and when they stand up, they can actually make a difference that is real um, and that isn't just cosmetic. So, we're starting our first Give journey and this morning we're going to start looking at social issues. So let's get some ideas about what different types of social issues there are. 45% of LGBT students are bullied in school. 4 million children in the UK live in poverty. One in two of us will get cancer. 75% of people with a mental health problem are not receiving treatment. There are 700,000 young carers in the UK. For raising awareness, we need something that catches people's attention. OK, what about a protest? What if we make it a silent protest? The key thing here is that I want you to make sure that you can be heard even right at the back of the room and that you use your best public speaking skills. Today's event is obviously a celebration of all of you. You've all been involved in First Give and today we're going to be hearing all about the work that you have all done on the programme. Today is such a wonderful day for me because it's not just the role that the young people played but actually it brings the young people into the community. So really, I'm so impressed. I'm very, very happy. I wish all the schools would do this. All of the causes were really local. They all meant something to the kids. And I think that's where the magic of First Give really is. It's connecting young people and the community in a way that's really unique. 